Hello, hello, hello. This is Swagonaut, and I am back from the future. Of course, I'm not back from the future, but <laughs> I can bring you some info on The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. So, basically, in this video, I'll basically tell you the release date, what system it comes out for and the release date don't forget it comes out for different countries uh, such as Japan and uh, places in Europe and Australia and stuff like that but I'll get into that um, later I'll get into the new system that they have it's it's the same it's same um, aspects same look but it's well polished the maps are bigger and um, they're better and I'll get to the features that it has. And I'll also get into the plot. I won't get into a lot of the plot. Because I don't want to spoil anything for you. But I will get to the basics. So you can know what you're dealing with. If you never played Zelda. You don't know the story. I'll tell you uh, just just a little bit about it. Just for you to know what's going on. And uh, yeah, just, just a little bit. Not a lot. So stay tuned. Alright, so first of all, I'll get in for the release dates. And for us, for most of my viewers, it's going to be for North America. So for us, it comes out November tw the 20th, 2011. November 20th, 2011. For Europe, it actually comes out two days earlier. So it's coming out November the 18th, 2011. For people in Japan, it comes out on the 23rd. 2011 in Australia it comes out the 24th 2011 so um Europe will be getting it first then it's going to be people in North America us then it's going to be people in Japan then Australia so yeah, not a big deal um the release dates are packed into the same week so it's uh, not a big difference so the week won't be long Alright, so I'll get into the system. For this system, it's different. It's definitely this different. It's for the Wii. And uh, with the Wii Motion Plus, you can uh, actually move your sword and whatever gadget you're using. So it's it's not a press a button and it'll strike your sword. It's different. It's more realistic since you do have to use the Wii, Wii Remote and such as that. But you know what? It's different different features same, same story not the same story but same gameplay but different way of playing it you get more control of it and there's some more gadgets so he still has his sword and bow that's um old school Zelda he has his shield he but now he also has like um mechanical flying beetles which, which can grab items that you can't get from a distance they have bombs a slingshot uh, that looks cool <laughs> beating a bad guy with a slingshot alright <laughs> and um all that you have to use the Wii Remote to accurately hit the enemy and uh, it'll, it'll be hard at first but as soon as you get into it it'll, it'll you adjust to it there you go you adjust to the Wii Remote and the system of that so as I am getting to the plot, don't want to tell you much again, don't want to tell you much, but I do want to give you some background on it. So Link, you know, guy in a green tight with the sword, with the shield, his name is Link, if you didn't know. And um, he was born in Skyloft, which is basically islands in the sky, so floating islands in the sky above the clouds. And um, one day he finds a sword, and with that sword, it leads him to well, well things happen, and then he is brought to Earth. So there's um, islands in the sky. Then he finds a sword, then um, things happen. Don't want to tell you, but um, he is led to I don't want to say Earth, but I, I, I just want to say land. So he's not in the sky no, anymore, and he has to fight evil bad guy and go go the story. But you do get the option to go back to the 
the floating island Skyloft and go back to the land. You know, you go back to Skyloft, fix your weapons, make new weapons. That's one feature that I've seen. You can make weapons. You find little items and then some pe- uh, person crafts it for you. Like Minecraft, I guess. Take some items and you craft something new. That's what it is. And you can also upgrade things. So, with this new system that they have um the game is well polished the maps are better you don't need to actually stop to actually heal yourself gameplay is um it's the same it's the same but i as i told you you need more control since you do have the wii you don't only press buttons so more controls gameplay is almost similar to the last one so one little thing i will give you that the sword that you have the skyward sword spoiler but throughout the game at some point of time is going to be the master sword and you'll get to know what that is and uh there's zelda uh in the game you find out all about these characters do want to do not want to tell you much about it but the evil guy is uh I don't know how to say it, but it's spelled G H I R A H I M. I'm gonna take a shot. Gilliman? Gilliman? Yeah, you know what? Uh, I don't know how to say it, but um, G H I R A H I M. That's an evil bad guy you need to beat. And what so? So, basically, that's it. Leave a like if you like it, and subscribe because I will keep you updated.